This is assigned to many clinic sessions, okay? But only one nurse at a time is assigned to the clinic session, only one doctor is assigned to the clinic session at a time, all right? Now, clinic session, we could have clinic session number as the primary key. Uh, we need to keep track of the date of the clinic, yeah, as well. And patients <coughs> attend clinic sessions, yeah. So that would be an original many-to-many -many relationship. Attends. Okay. So we need to decompose it and put in a link entity. And we'll call that clinic appointment. Okay, so the many ends now go into the link entity. And the original ends now become one. So we have patient number as part of the primary key, yeah, and clinic session. The foreign key on its own, yeah. And we have clinic session. <laughs> Sorry, I'm going a bit mad now. Clinic session number. Uh, also as the foreign key and is the primary key of that. Now this can be organized um, a bit more elegantly, all right? But what I do, because I've actually, it's been a bit of a day already for you, okay? So what I do next week is I'll go through how that can be, a li you know, uh, created a little more elegantly, okay? And what we're going to do is we're going to use this particular uh, entity relationship diagram and we're going to decide whether a relationship is optional or mandatory. All right? All right. So we're extending our model. But you really do need to look at the recordings 